<clears throat> so in the last class, <clears throat> though I have started with the introduction part of the vermi composting, but uh, I was just looking into the syllabus, so I just got to know that there was waste and the door management topic that how it needs to be managed. So I have just taken a part of it. I'll be taking it up today for some time in order to discuss how we can have an improvement in how we can manage the waste and how we can manage the door. Uh, so I'll be talking about that today and then we'll follow up with the vermi composting part. <clears throat> Just let me know when the slides they are visible to you. <clears throat> slides visible here. Huh? Yes. Yes, sir. OK, thank you. So <clears throat> I've just talked about that. What kind of waste is being uh, can be utilized in order to have the. Uh, this compost and it included agriculture waste. It can have uh, some of the industrial effluents like I have told you like canes coming out of sugar cane once they have been processed as a sugar for sugar and then they can be used up in order to have this compost or coming rice uh, husk that can also be used as a waste in order to have the compost to be ready. So these are all uh, things that we have talked about. So there was one thing that how it can be managed, how waste should be managed and how a door if that is a major issue, that is the major problem, how it should be managed. In the starting, I've shown you a slide where a landfill area was being shown up in Delhi. I have told you that it's not only a door that is coming up in that area. We know that. I mean, you just imagine that any uh, while, while you are on the road and there is any uh, truck that is taking up garbage. So there is very foul smell that is coming out of that truck. So there are a number of reasons uh, behind that, uh, that that why uh, such kind of door is being emitted out. And apart from that, if you just imagine that if a pile, thousands of those trucks, they are being created, they are stocked at one particular place. Now, what kind of uh, emissions there would be and how we can manage them, how they can be controlled. And definitely it needs to be done because that is an important exercise. If it cannot be controlled, then the things won't work in order to have the compost on a very large scale. So the best way what have been written over here, I'll be going in one uh, one by one into each of these. Uh, they say that a door avoidance during planning. So when you were putting up a site, when you were having a plan, OK, you need to have the compost ready, site selection, uh, where it should be, whether it should be away from any residential area or any work area or any schools if they are nearby. So they should be away from that place. That can be one my year, but still you cannot control the door if it is coming on a very large scale and. Uh, because. 
डोर बेसिकली है क्या इट्स परसीव बाय आर ओल्ड फैक्ट्री एंड आर नर्व दे रिस्पॉन्ड टू इट बाय टेलिंग आर ब्रेन दैट समथिंग फाउल इज बींग इज बींग देयर सो selecting the site is one particular thing okay we can select a site which is not located in a nearby areas it's in a outskirt but nowadays there is no way there is no area which you say that is not approachable or is not reachable second thing that they say here during planning is that how the things they should be taken up i mean what kind of waste should be produced how it should be utilized can we minimize the waste production first at first instance if it is being produced can it be used <clears throat> in any other process nowadays the other processes means that there are biodiesel biofuels that are coming up so can the waste be utilized by the industries in order to have and then okay if there is no option let let us go for compost so having compost is not a bad idea but anything that is related to the compost any harmful effects that are coming is not always good so it's not about the foul smell that is coming but there can be flies there can be rat rodents so there can be mosquitoes a major problem can be created in that area so they say that it can be avoided during planning so site consideration and a door dispersion analysis dispersion means that how the door is being spreaded out how it is coming up so obviously कंपोस्ट है अगर बाहर किसी रीजन में है ओपन है कंट्रोल्ड कंपोस्ट नहीं है कंट्रोल्ड एयर एनवायरनमेंट नहीं है जिस जहां से स्लरी जो भी है वो लेके जा रहा है जो ट्रक है वो ओपन है फाइन एंड इट इज डिस्कार्डिंग द वेस्ट ऑन द रोड्स ऑन द साइड्स जहां भी वो जा रहा है सो हाउ दीज थिंग्स दे शुड बी कंट्रोल विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट दैट एंड देन अडोर अवॉइडेंस बाय कंसिडरिंग द फूड वेस्ट हायर एयर there is a hierarchy that has been created that first minimize the waste if it is not being controlled up if the waste is being produced how it can be effectively utilized can it be given to the humans who cannot afford food then if it's not can it be fed to the animals nahi hai chalo theek hai agar animals bhi nahi hai to industrial waste mein to chala hi jayega na industry mein hame kuch khane wala pardarth to chahiye nahi usse kuch aisi cheeze produce hongi jo Uh, which can be used as a fuel so that can be done if that is not the option go for composting and the final would be that okay then if not compost is not possible that is the last step then go for the land filling area so compost is very crucial in order to have that zero waste management because effluents will be produced from the first hierarchy to the last one until the compost has been there so zero waste management compost pe aake hi khatam hoti hai उसके बाद तो फिर लैंड फिलिंग ही है जो आप लोग देख रहे हो विच द प्रॉब्लम हैज बन देयर थर्ड पॉइंट इज दैट अडोर अवॉइडेंस बाय ऑप्टिमाइज्ड फैसिलिटी ऑपरेशंस बेस्ट मैनेजमेंट प्रैक्टिसेस सो बेस्ट मैनेजमेंट गुड गुड प्रैक्टिसेस सो दीस प्रैक्टिसेस दे अलाउ दैट ओके द थिंग्स दे हैव बीन इन अ वेरी कंट्रोल्ड मैनर द थिंग्स दे हैव बीन टेकन वेल केयर ऑफ द पर्संस दोस हैव बीन हैंडलिंग दे आर ट्रेंड इन अ वेरी वेल मैनर in order to ensure that there is no leakage any kind of complaint if they are being raised they are being answered and they are being managed so that that considerations they become an important point where you can actually have a control of the sewer and at last finally controlling the sewer as such so you can use any biological means chemical or thermal means in order to control that compost So I've already talked about that site selection is very important. That you need to be very careful that site is okay. It's quite a way. Now just see the expansion thing. If we think of planning of putting up a site in near areas in Delhi or maybe in Delhi NCR, now there is no place that is not approachable. The communication, the mode of uh, transport has increased to such an extent. That there is no way by which you can say वो area तो approachable नहीं है वो पहले की बातें थी that people they used to stay in villages and there aage 100 km tak kuch bhi nahi hai wahan pe ek jagah hai bana di gayi hai that could have been possible now but now it's not there now if it is not there just imagine the scenario in delhi in faridabad in noida that you cannot select any area which you can say it's very far away from delhi 
say if it's far delhi has extended its uh, its uh, zone to all the areas covering up the major span a very big span that has been covered up by delhi state only aur uske bahar kya hai har jagah pe सोनीपत देख लो यहाँ से फरीदाबाद के आगे पलवल देख लो सोना देख लो यहाँ नोएडा के आगे गाजियाबाद देख लो सो देर यू कैन नॉट फाइंड एनी प्लेस वेयर यू कैन हैव इट सो व्हाट सेकंड थिंग यू कैन हैव अपार्ट फ्रॉम साइट सिलेक्शन इज फूड रिकवरी फूड रिकवरी दैट कैन बी कैन यू अवॉइड वेस्टिंग फूड कैन इट बी डन इट कैन बी कंट्रोल्ड मे बी देर आर सो मेनी कंट्रीज दैट है टेकन सच स्टेप्स यू मस्ट हैव सीन दैट uh there have been uh, these uh, ads or not ads would say some uh, content on the facebook that shows that okay there are some countries that have uh, refrigerators installed on the roads and they people there they have the used food is left over there so that other humans those who cannot afford can feed upon it so is there any way by which the food can be recovered it, the wastage can be minimized that is the first step if it is that possible that is good if still not there that is the waste food can it be fed to the animals the animals may be gaushala mein hai ya aur kahin bhi hai ya galiyon mein yahan pe to india mein bahut sari options hai where the hungry animals they can be fed if that is not again possible or you cannot find out way okay can that effluent can that waste be provided to the industry so that they can work upon it they can <clears throat> extract anything out of it but still you have the effluent that is again being discharged out of the industries as well then if these things they have been minimized okay then go for compost because that is ultimately you are actually decomposing the entire waste jahan se insaan ko kuch nahi mil raha hai iska matlab ye nahi hai ki uske upar kuch feed nahi ho sakta hai us pe जानवर फीड कर सकते हैं अगर वो भी पॉसिबल नहीं है देन देर आर माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम दैट कैन बी फीडेड एंड दे कैन डिग्रेड इट इन टू अट इज दैट इज द गोल ऑफ हैविंग द कम्पोस्ट इफ दैट इज बींग अचीव दैट इज अ ग्रेट थिंग इन स्टेड ऑफ हैविंग द लैंड फिल सो दैट इज द लास्ट रिजॉर्ट टू डिस्पोज एनी थिंग दैट कैन नॉट बी प्रोसेस सो पिछली बार जब शक्ति ने एक पॉइंट उठाया था कि सर how about the plastic eating bacteria I have pointed out that though it is there but you never know that how much time it would take to act upon it so plastics if they are being there they take years thousands of years to get degraded by naturally by themselves so that are ultimately leading to creation of landfills because by that time compost cannot be created out of plastic so if that can be worked upon that is a very great way finally to have uh, a door management and to have the waste management process that is the first thing that you have an appropriate mixture of what is being created natural leaf falls hain natural straws hain ya husk hai that is coming out that can be taken that can be utilized in order to have the compost is a good way of managing all those things but a stuff just imagine if country is producing so much of waste from their homes उसमें खाना है खाना फेंक दिया जा रहा है छपाती हैं छपातियाँ फेंक दी जा रही हैं नॉट बींग फीडेड टू एनिमल्स और एनी काइंड ऑफ सब्जियां हैं या कुछ भी वेस्ट है हमारे यहाँ पे तो सब्जी बनाने में बहुत चीजें यूज होती हैं देर आर स्पाइसेस देर आर ऑयल्स देर आर सो मेनी थिंग्स दैट आर बींग यूज अप एक्सॉटिक फूड्स और उसमें बहुत सारी चीजें यूज होती है लहसुन वगैरह अदरक एंड देन दे आर मिक्स अप बट जस्ट इमेजिन दैट ऑल दैट कंटेंट इफ इट इज इन हायर अमाउंट that becomes those things becomes very difficult in order to have them managed so in a way to control a door out of it the food segregation the food waste disposal all these things they come into play so that is we already have discussed all those points will not be talking about that but how the best practices can be adopted in order to minimize so collection at source food segregation that is already have been discussed and then transportation jo trucks जो डम्प्स हैं जो उनको लेके जा रहे हैं जस्ट इमेजिन दैट डम्प्स वी हैव यूज टू हैव बाय म्यूनसिपल कॉर्पोरेशन एक जगह बना देते थे कि आप अपने घर का कूड़ा जो है उस जगह पे आके डिस्कार्ड कर दीजिए सो आफ्टर फ्यू डेज यू कैन जस्ट फील दैट ओ फाउल स्मेल्स दे आर कमिंग आउट ऑफ दैट प्लेस उसके नेबरिंग कोई भी लोग नहीं जाना पसंद करते थे इवन वेन वी यूज टू क्रॉस द रोड्स वी यूज टू पुट हैंड्स ऑन आर नोज कवर्ड नोज इन ऑर्डर टू अवॉइड दैट दैट प्लेस so that is very much there so can these things be managed can these things be taken care of 
so we need to have the transportation the trucks that we have the lodging uh, facilities they should be properly covered ensuring that nothing waste is coming nothing is falling out of that truck and uh, it's totally being covered no foul smells are coming out of that place until and unless it is being dropped at one particular place in order to have managed over there for compost generation and then drop off at processing facility so drop off is that okay they have been dropped off now there are so many things that will be coming out of that place leachate leachate वर्ड मैंने बहुत पहले भी लेक्चर में यूज करा है कि लीचिंग होती है लीचिंग बेसिकली है क्या इट्स नथिंग इट्स द व्हेन वाटर कंटेंट इज मोर सो दैट माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स दैट कंटेंट इट मिक्स अप विद दैट वाटर एंड वाटर लीचेस आउट ऑफ दैट स्टफ एंड इट कम्स आउट सो दैट वाटर ऑब्वियसली इट्स कैरिंग नंबर ऑफ थिंग्स एंड इट्स अपने अंदर बहुत सारी चीजें लेके वो बाहर आता है उसमें माइक्रोब्स होते हैं सो so, what kind of food is being there that was there so be just imagine that if any food is there that contains sulfur that will obviously sulfur ki bahut gandi smell hoti hai to wo smell wahan pe hogi hogi to wo leachate jo hai agar wo bahar aa raha hai so that will be another problem so that will again create a huge problem uh, at the site where the compost is being regulated so we need to be ensured that the composting process happens in a way that everything is controlled everything is taken in a very uh, controlled manner agar pata hai leachate hai to usme hum dry stuff kitna add kar sakte hain jisme there can be straws there can be paddy unused a uh, used paddy and then there can be dried uh, canes used canes that can be stuffed into it so that wo leachate ki jo problem hai wo avoid ho sake कंपोस्ट की जो नेचुरल जगह होती हैं जहां मैंने आपको दिखाया था दैट दे हैव क्रिएटेड द साइट्स लाइक दीज सो दे यूज्ड टू हैव दिस कवर्ड अप फ्रॉम ऑल द प्लेसेस सो दैट वाटर मे नॉट लीच आउट अपार्ट फ्रॉम इट यू कैन हैव द प्लास्टिक शीट्स क्योंकि प्लास्टिक डीकंपोज इजीली नहीं होता है यू कैन हैव द प्लास्टिक शीट्स सो दैट वाटर मे नॉट सीप सीपेज through below this point and may not create problem just below in the ground water or at any level so that is the drop off at processing facility then air control jaise hi maine bataya transport mein wo truck covered hai that is one thing and then apart from it that uh, when it has been processed when it has reached at one site to wo site agar city ke uh, vicinity mein hai तो वहां पे क्या कंट्रोल्ड एयर एनवायरनमेंट है दैट एयर यू हैव इज नॉट एग्जिटिंग आउट सो दैट इज द नेगेटिव प्रेशर इज बीइंग मेंटेन फॉर द एयर इट इज बीइंग सर्कुलेटेड इनसाइड ओनली क्या वो चीजें मेंटेन है एंड वेदर दे आर रिक्वायर्ड यस दैट कैन बी प्रैक्टिस स्टोरेज ऑफ मटेरियल कहां पे स्टोर हो रहा है कैसे स्टोर हो रहा है कैसे रखा जा रहा है सो दैट बिकम्स रियली वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो दे टॉक अबाउट वेन वी टॉक अबाउट ऑफ मैनेजमेंट दे से दे मेरे ये कहने का मतलब है जो साइंटिस्ट जिन्होंने रिसर्च करी ओवर द इयर्स दे से दैट देयर आर टू काइंड ऑफ वेस्ट दैट कम्स आउट वन इज द ऑर्गेनिक वेस्ट दैट इज कमिंग आउट ऑफ द एंटायरली वेस्ट प्रोडक्ट्स दैट इज बीइंग देयर एंड देन देयर इज फार्म वेस्ट एंड एनिमल मेन्यूज एंड मेनी अदर थिंग्स दैट इज कमिंग आउट एंड हाउ द थिंग्स दे नीड टू बी मिक्स्ड अप दैट इज हाउ दे शुड बी केप्ट व्हेन दे आर नॉट बीइंग प्रोसेस्ड फॉर द कंपोस्ट अगर उनको सिर्फ स्टोर करा गया है तो वो कैसे रखना है दे नीड टू बी कवर्ड अप कवरिंग बहुत तरह से होती है आदर यू हैव द कंपोस्ट बनी हुई कंपोस्ट से ही उसको कवर कर दो तो उससे स्मेल आनी भी बाहर बंद हो जाती है बिकॉज इट प्रोवाइड्स अ बायोलॉजिकल फिल्म काइंड ऑफ दैट कवर इज देयर इन सेकेंड इज दैट द फाउल स्मेल इज नॉट एमिटिंग आउटसाइड सो दैट काइंड ऑफ कवर्स दे कैन बी प्रोवाइडेड अप एंड देन हाउस कीपिंग दैट इज दैट इफ इट इज बींग not being controlled so truck se agar garbage bahar gir raha hai ya kahin pe side pe kuch gand hai to it needs to be cleaned up at a very regular interval so that needs to be taken care of in order to have such things in order to have the door management control kaise kara ja sakta hai composting ek to enclosed composting ki baat kar rahe hain that you maintain the every process and you have the closure unit the closed unit bins mein practice kara ja sakta hai ya pits mein जिसको ऊपर से 
कवर कर दिया जाता है सो दैट कैन बी डन इन वन वे एयर कंट्रोल्ड इंक्लोजर सो दैट एड्स टू द कॉस्ट इफ द वेस्ट इज बींग प्रोड्यूस एट वायर एट अ वेरी हायर अमाउंट इन अ वेरी हायर अमाउंट फ्रॉम द सिटीज सो गवर्नमेंट्स दे नीड टू कम अप विद द म्यूनसिपल कॉरपोरेशन दैट ओके वी नीड टू सेट अप अ प्लान इन ऑर्डर टू हैव दैट एयर कंट्रोल्ड क्लोजर्स वेयर द कम्पोस्ट इज बींग प्रोसेस्ड अप एंड देन एट लास्ट देर इज ओपन कम्पोस्टिंग अगर ओपन भी है तो उसमें बोलते हैं कि ओनली यार्ड एंड अ गार्डन वेस्ट is suitable in order to have it an open closure otherwise there is no other waste that can be processed into it so there are some cons that are being related to have limitations jo kal yuvraj ne shayad question point out kara tha parso and then best practices mein the staff it should be trained the staff who is handling the stuff who is actually taking care at the compost site they need to be very well trained that training is to be imparted through the educated uh, uh, faculties or the manpower that has been generated in order to impart education to the uh, unknown people so that they can handle the stuff at a very uh, uh, at a very i mean say i would say in a very good in a very mannered way so that things may not get uh, weighed away by this uh, कंपोस्ट और डोर या उसको कैसे मैनेज करना है वो खराब ना हो तो उस तरह से वो स्टाफ इट शुड बी ट्रेन एनफ एंड मैनेज मैनेजमेंट ऑफ प्रोसेस बाय प्रोडक्ट सो एनी प्रोडक्ट दैट इज कमिंग आउट ऑफ इट लीचेट की मैंने बात करी थी उसके अलावा बहुत सारे ऐसे प्रोडक्ट्स होते हैं विच कैन स्टे देयर प्लास्टिक्स इफ दे आर बींग मिक्सड अप दे कैन नॉट बी डिग्रेडेड सो दे नीड टू बी सेग्रीगेटेड दे नीड टू बी सेपरेटेड सो दैट बाय प्रोडक्ट्स दे नीड टू बी टेकन केयर ऑफ इफ यू कैन मैनेज दैट अ डोर कैन बी मैनेज वेल complaints management that is again a very important thing that if you manage those complaints if they are coming up that okay there is smell or there is leakage there is seepage nearby area se kuch complaint lodge hoti hai they need to be taken care of and they need to be operationalized okay we need to control it we need to control it so that is management for the complaints and then okay there they talk about that वेस्ट मटेरियल का जो ट्रांसपोर्ट सिस्टम है इट शुड बी कवर्ड देयर कहां से मतलब अडोर के चांसेस कहां से हैं पैदा होने के सो देयर आर ट्रक्स देयर आर टिपिंग ऑपरेशंस ओपन कन्वेयर्स जो सामान को लेके जाते हैं स्पिलेज ट्रक से जो सामान गिर रहा है देन देयर नीड्स टू बी प्री प्रोसेसिंग एंड स्टोरेज ये प्री प्रोसेसिंग वाला पार्ट वही है सेग्रीगेट करके उसको एक इंग्लाइंट प्लेटफॉर्म पे रख दिया जाए ताकि लीचेड जो है उसको पहले ही अलग कर दिया जाए यू हैव एनफ ऑफ द ड्राई मटेरियल that is being processed up further ahead when you create the compost so that pre processing and taking care of how it is being stored up and then compost loading ultimately creating a heap that needs to be taken care of so yahan ye cheeze bahut matter karti heap kaisi bani hai microbes kaise grow kar rahe hain andar because ultimately the foul smell then it would be there and then a door ke source processing ke time pe jahan pe main process ho raha hota hai So what kind of microbes they are coming up? What kind of material, food material that has been provided to them? That is very much important. Oi bhi aise sulfites hain, kuch bhi aise ammonia ki production ho rahi hai, methane gas ki production hai. Aisi jo gases hain jo emit hoti hain, obviously the odor would be there. So that that will be creating a main problem. Then post processing and storage. So post processing is that you have completely the compost is ready. Now you have completely processed it that is jab ban gayi hai uske baad ki processing wahi hota hai ki wo dry ho jaye enough that ultimately it can be stored up in bags and at one particular place so that nothing any kind of smell may not come out of that stored product so it is dried up so that is important thing that needs to be taken care of so this is the substances that are actually being used up at composting facilities so you need to take care of that sulfur compounds in a reduced way that they are taken up there so this sulfur ki smell bilkul rotten eggs ki jaise hoti hai then volatile fatty acids that are present in initial phase of composting smell like vinegar then nitrogen compounds often ammonia iska take care karna bahut zaruri hai indoles and scatols that are naturally occurring in faces that are being used up so fecal matter ka kya dhyan rakhna hai wo zaruri hai so feces that are being used up it need to be ensured that from what animal they are coming up so it's not always good to have feces fecal matter from all the animals 
फार्म एनिमल्स उनमें भी बोलते हैं कि द एनिमल्स दैट फीड अपॉन वेजिटेटिव ग्रोथ दे आर गुड एनफ इन ऑर्डर टू हैव बिन यूज अप इन कम्पोज लाइक काउडंग और फीड कमिंग फ्रॉम हॉर्सेज और रेबिट्स दैट कैन बी यूज अप कीटोन्स ऑब्वियसली दीज कीटोन्स दे अगेन स्मेल लाइक एसीटोन और नेल पॉलिश रिमूवर यहाँ पे लिखा है सो दैट इज नॉट ऑलवेज गुड एल डी हाइड्स दैट कैन कम आउट ऑफ एक्सीडेशन ऑफ एल्कोहल्स एंड दे प्रोड्यूस अनप्लेजेंट अटोर सो ऑल दीज टफ दे नीड टू बी टेकन केयर ऑफ एंड वी आर मिक्सिंग अप तो करना क्या है अल्टीमेटली गोल क्या है हाउ इट विल बी मैनेज सेग्रीगेशन एट द टेक पॉइंट गोइंग फॉर फूड हायर आयर की वेस्टेज ज्यादा ना हो अगर हो भी रही है तो जो मिक्सचर है जो कार्बन नाइट्रोजन रेशियो का जो मिक्सचर है या और भी जो फूड स्टफ है जस्ट बी इंश्योर्ड व्हाट क्वालिटी हेयर आई वुड टॉक अबाउट द वर्ड क्वालिटी कि वेस्ट भी किस क्वालिटी का है उसमें ऐसी चीजें तो नहीं है जो अल्टीमेटली बहुत ज्यादा अडोर पैदा करे जिससे माइक्रोब्स गंदे आए और उसकी वजह से प्रॉब्लम क्रिएट हो सो दल दो स्टफ दैट नीड्स टू बी टेकन केयर ऑफ दैट इज हाउ यू कैन मैनेज द वेस्ट एज वेल एज दर्ड आई होप द टॉपिक टॉपिक क्लियर टू ऑल ऑफ यू किसी का कोई सवाल है यहाँ पे प्लीज आप लोग पूछ सकते हैं दोस्तों एनी बड़ी एनी क्वेश्चन अधीश आयुषी सैम जहानवी नेहल साहिबा नो क्वेश्चन तनवी फाइन गाइस ओके so going back to the introduction part to what we have started with the vermi compost unit i was just reading was going through yesterday i was just going through that vermi compost so what i was getting in my mind okay can this unit be built up can we practice it can we go for it because you do not have to do anything and there can be a way where you can have a parallel income so i was just i am just talking about my perception so it depends upon how you look up to the things while i was reading it so there is nothing that is involved in vermi compost again the mixtures they are being taken up yahan pe koi ratios ka dhyan nahi rakhna hota what do you need to have a good quality of earth worms the natural decomposers bahut sare purane scientists ne maine aise kuch lines padhi thi jahan pe aristotle ne या डाबन ने ऐसी स्टेटमेंट्स दी थी दैट द बेस्ट फ्रेंड्स ऑफ द प्लेनेट दे आर अर्थ वॉर्म्स सो दे आर द बेस्ट नेचुरल डीकम्पोजर्स एंड एनी लीच इट एनी थिंग दैट इज कमिंग आउट ऑफ दैट दैट वॉर्म्स इज ऑलवेज गुड फॉर द प्लेनेट सो दैट इज द टर्मिनोलॉजी दैट आई गॉन थ्रू हाउ दिस ब्यूटिफुल लाइन्स दे हैव बिन सेंग्स दे हैव बिन देयर सो जस्ट इमेजिन यू जस्ट नीड टू पुट अप द थिंग्स टफ टूगेदर फाइन एंड यू पुट इन द वॉर्म्स ठीक है दो महीने के लिए छोड़ दो एंड योर स्टफ इज रेडी टू बींग सोल्ड अप एंड यू विल हैव नाउ व्हाट मटेरियल इज जस्ट इमेजिन द इनपुट इट्स टोटली फ्री इट विल बी वेस्ट मटेरियल बट यू नीड टू परचेज वन टाइम परचेज एज द वॉर्म्स दे आर वेरी चीप वॉर्म्स कैन बी प्रोवाइडेड फ्रॉम एनी अदर फेसिलिटीज बाय देम ड्रॉप दैम ऑफ अपने आप मल्टीप्लाई करते रहेंगे आपका वर्मी वॉर्म का कल्चर भी मेंटेन होता रहेगा plus you can have your compost out of it so when i was looking into that what advantages can be there and how it benefit so i was getting an idea that why not practice it why not why, why can't we have it i mean it's just the worms which do not cause any kind of harm to the uh, society or to the mankind why why they can't be sourced and can be practiced in order to have this kind of compost the compost which upon comparison was really good was far far better than uh, this natural compost that is coming out to fayda kya laga aaj ki date mein socho when there are so many effluents that are coming so many waste that is coming so that is totally free that is totally free i think i imagined that okay we can have a talk with the government agencies with the municipal corporations that uh, can this waste be utilized why can't we have those composting units vermi composting units where you just need to create the heaps put in the worms and let the work done by them and ultimately that products they can be sold off sold off means maybe they will not fetch money but ultimately something good is being happening so that will make a feel good factor that is that is that was there out of while i was reading it so 
when i looked into from the point of business it allured me more rather than just reading the content so that is what i want from you people that how being a life scientist the life sciences bachelors how you can actually fetch how you can actually reap uh, the skills out of your knowledge that you have gained and how it can be utilized to have entrepreneurship skills in you people so vermi composting is a i would not say a biotechnological process though there is being utilization of the worms so biotechnology ki definition yahi hai ki using uh, microbes for the benefit of mankind so vermi composting is simple process of composting in which you do not need to take care of any secondary factor just need to take care of the worms and your work is done so worms ko एक मॉइस्ट एनवायरनमेंट चाहिए होता है शेडी एरिया चाहिए होता है और क्या पॉपुलेशन उनकी अपने आप बढ़ रही है खाना उन्होंने खुद खा लेना है रिप्रोडक्शन उनकी हो रही है सो एवरीथिंग इज बीइंग इन अ कंट्रोल्ड मैनर एंड दे टेक केयर ऑफ ईच एंड एवरीथिंग सो दैट आर अर्थ वॉर्म्स दैट इज वाई देन नेम्ड एज अर्थ वॉर्म्स एंड दे आर यूज टू एनहांस द प्रोसेस ऑफ वेस्ट कन्वर्जन एंड प्रोड्यूस अ बेटर प्रोडक्ट फिर मैन काइंड की बात आ गई काइंड तो यहाँ पे दिखाते हैं लेकिन हमारा यही मोटो रहता है वी हैव द प्रायोरिटी हाउ वी कैन रीप एनी थिंग आउट ऑफ एनी थिंग दैट इज हैपनिंग ऑन द प्लेनेट सो अगेन वी आर यूजिंग इट सो वर्मी कम्पोस्ट इज अ मैथड ऑफ प्रिपेयरिंग एनरिच्ड कम्पोस्ट ये एक बड़ी बात थी मैंने अभी बोला था कि जब दोनों कम्पोस्ट को कंपेयर करा सो दिस कम्पोस्ट वॉज रियली गुड इन क्वालिटी इन कंटेंट इन न्यूट्रिशियन दैट विल बी प्रोवाइडेड टू द प्लांट्स इन कंपेरिजन टू द नॉर्मल कम्पोस्ट with the use of earth worms it is one of the easiest method to recycle agricultural waste and to produce quality compost agricultural waste ah yahan pe use kara gaya hai word but it can be any waste that is coming from uh, the cities organic waste because worms they can be feed with that stuff so worms they'll feed upon it necessarily it does not need to be agriculture waste but worms they do have the perception किसी वॉम्स को चाइनीज स्टफ पसंद है कोई थाई फूड प्रेफर करता है किसी को इंटरनेशनल फूड अच्छा है मैक्सिकन किसी को ठीक लगता है सो दे हैव देयर ओन परसेप्शन ऑफ हैविंग द फूड व्हिच व्हिच दे कैन रीसाइकल इट जस्ट जस्ट इमेजिन दैट दे आर टेकिंग इन द फूड दे आर एक्सक्रीटिंग इट एंड दे आर एक्चुअली एडिंग टू द न्यूट्रिशनल कंटेंट तो वो वॉम्स की क्वालिटी क्या है जितना उनका वेट होता है उतना ही खाना वो खा सकते हैं इफ दे वे से हंड्रेड ग्राम्स दे कैन ईट हंड्रेड ग्राम्स एंड आई जस्ट रेड येस्टरडे ओनली दैट इन फ्यू डेज दस किलो तक वो कंपोज जो है वो तैयार कर देते हैं इन जस्ट फ्यू डेज ऑफ टाइम एंड दे कैन फीड अपॉन जस्ट वन टेंथ द प्रोडक्ट दैट हैज बिन प्रोड्यूस दैट दे कैन फीड अपॉन इट तो वो वो एक बहुत अचंबे वाली बात थी कि इतनी जल्दी ये चीज़ें प्रोसेस करते हैं सो दे हैव ऑल द एडेड बेनिफिट्स माइक्रोब्स में हम लोगों को ध्यान रखना पड़ता था कि कंटेंट क्या है इसमें उसका ध्यान रखने की इतनी ज़रूरत नहीं है सो वी नीड टू क्रिएट दैट मिक्सचर बिकॉज वॉम्स विल अल्टीमेटली विल फीड अपॉन इट नाउ इन ऑर्डर टू हैव द वॉम्स फीड अपॉन इट जस्ट मेक इट श्योर कि वो बिट्स में है पीसेज में है रेदर दैन लार्जर पीसेज सो दैट वॉम्स कैन ईजिली फीड अपॉन इट तो क्या होगा अगर कुछ बड़ा पीस है उसको फीड करने की कोशिश करेंगे नहीं कर पाए दे लीव इट सेकेंड एरिएशन की कोई जरूरत ही नहीं है खुद ही अंदर होल्स में दे डेक इन टू एंड दे आर क्रिएटिंग एयर स्पेसेस मॉइस्चर दैट मीन्स टू बी टेकन केयर ऑफ जस्ट मेक इट इन श्योर दैट दे आर नॉट डायरेक्टली इन सन बिकॉज अल्टीमेटली देन दे फाइंड द वे टू एंटर इन साइड द अर्थ क्योंकि ये फिर प्लैनेट uh, के अर्थ uh, के अंदर रहना पसंद करते हैं सॉइल के कुछ सेंटीमीटर्स अंदर तक ये लोग ये रहना पसंद करते हैं सो दैट नीड्स टू बी टेकन केयर ऑफ एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट ऑक्सीजन एरिएशन वो प्रॉपर क्रिएट कर ही रहे हैं पीएच से उनको कोई बहुत ज़्यादा फर्क पड़ता नहीं है बिकॉज दे आर नेचुरल डीकम्पोज एंड दे जस्ट नीड टू हैव दैट फूड स्टफ दे फीड पॉनेट जैसा फूड होगा उनको मिला वैसा ही वो बाई uh, प्रोडक्ट जो है वो बनाते रहेंगे so ultimately what they are leaching out of them is um, is very good in nutrition not about the animal nutrition but plant nutrition stuff jo hai wo bahut achhi tarah se because they will release carbon nitrogen uh, they will release uh, uh, sodium potassium phosphorus magnesium uh, 
copper, iron, so that all those stuff that is coming out of them and that too far better than the natural compost process. Having the process speeded up with a good quality, just by putting in the worms, they will do it naturally. That is a very good advantage of having the vermi compost. So when we actually talk, when we switch to vermi compost rather than the organic compost, there are certain things that we need to think about that in a country like India, where we have four major seasons and then in, in seasons, it becomes really difficult to have the site composting, the sites that need to be done. So adjustments need to be made to be done in order to have that good compost out of them. Food scraps, they need to be handled properly so that they don't pose a doors or attract unwanted insects or animals. On-site composting takes very little time or equipment. So these are Imagine, I mean, practice, jo karne se pehle dhyan mein rakhni zaruri hoti hai. But now just think about vermi compost. Vermi compost se equipment ki isme zarurat hai hi nahi hai. Just need to have those pits rounded up that any other animal, they may not enter inside rodents vagera usme andar na jayen, worms ko khada inge. So you actually take care of the worms rather than taking care of the mixture rather than taking care of the compost and if you can do it that is definitely a very good achievable way by which you can actually produce the compost so if that is done your work is very simple shade hai covered hai rain nahi ja, ja rahi hai andar aapne material liya just sprinkle some water upon it put in the worms worms dalne ke baad thoda sa food stuff aur dal do cover ho gaya hai cover it up so that worms, because they uh, they like humid environment, so they they'll just work. That they work wonders. They work wonders when you just see up the things, how they can. So creating a compost when we talk about the large piles, they may take up to years, and manual turning can uh, speed up the process. Compost, however, should not be putting up soil to the house plants because the presence of weed and grass weeds can actually hamper the process. You can leave grass clippings on the lawn known as grass cycling. So that can be practiced. You can put leaves. Grass cycling ki baat, jo Delhi wali wo image hai, photo mein nahi dikhai thi, jo grass grow kar rahi hai, green uspe. So that is always there. And you can put the leaves aside and use them as mulch around trees and scrubs to retain moisture. So that was the added benefit of how the compost can be used. So this is vermi compost is, is totally a different way where you actually use up worms. So here the word red worms has been used up. It's the type of uh, tiger worms. Echinadia, uh, Fidolia, something like that. One name was their scientific name. So that is the quality, the tiger worms. They are naturally being found all over the planet. Was confined majorly to European nations, but because of their quality, quality care, I will tell you that it's not that they eat Indian food, but uh, they are very fast decomposers and they feed upon waste. And if you want to have natural population being recovered up from say 100 grams, 100 grams, if you have 500 grams, then it is only animal manure, animal excreta, wo waste, aiye, usme dal do unko, kuch time mein unki population double ho jayegi. So their population time, doubling time is good. Uh, they are very simple worms, had a very good, uh, so have a very good speed in order to work as decomposers. So all these qualities, they make these red worms very good. So in appearance, they appear like red in color. So that is why they have been named as red worms. In bins, they feed upon foods, food scraps. Just a second, guys. When they be put in the bins on food scraps or yard trimmings, they work upon the organic matter to create the compost. That is what I am talking about. The worms break down this material into high quality compost called castings. Worm bins are easy to construct and are also available for purchase. I don't think that we need to have purchased them. They can be created all the year round in a very simple manner. You just need to create a dig a pit and Put up some bricks at the site, your work is done. So no need to purchase them. 
but warm bins they work in a benefit i'll i'll be coming to the method when they are being used up so those bins they actually have trays unke andar trays hoti hain to wo ek tray jab feed kar lete hain now the leachate will be coming out that organic mixture so you can take out that tray fine put another tray at the top with the worms so that again the material may start so continuous process wo chalta rehta hai so that is the good thing about the bins only then you need to purchase them 1 pound 450 grams that is 1 pound of mature worms contains around 800 to 1000 worms and they can eat up half a pound of organic material per day 250 gram tak gand jo hai wo roz kha sakte hain the bins can be sized to match the volume of food scraps so they can be uh, modified they can be changed as per your need Uh, that will be turned into castings so it takes around 3 to 4 months to produce usable casting so that is a good thing 3 se 4 mahine mein bilkul natural <coughs> wo aapke paas hoga isme ek fayda hota hai isko ek word use karte hain that is vermi leachate that they use that the leach that is coming out of the organic material that you have that is the compost vermi compost usme agar aap pani thoda mix karke you take it into tap Uh, out of the tap that water mixed with that components can be used by foliage spray spray karke aap plants ko natural way mein unko uh, grow kara sakte ho without use of any anything any chemicals or anything in means that any food stuff need not to be given to the plants so that is a very natural way <clears throat> that water usko kuch bolte hain so i'll be coming to that part so it takes the castings they can be used as potting soil the other by products of vermi composting known as warm tea is a high quality liquid fertilizer yahan pe wo warm tea word use kar raha i have read something else it was not tea can be used as high quality liquid fertilizers for house plants or gardens definitely i'll be going for it will will surely practice it uh, this worms pata karta hu kahan se milenge so will definitely go for it i'll stop here so we'll take it up in the next class as of now any questions from today's part guys please ayushi sam adhish kuch puchta nahi hai shakti shivani manaswini yukta vivek tanvi uh, so i don't have any question self explanatory अधीश क्या बोल रहे हो यस सर सर आई वाज टेलिंग कि टॉपिक्स इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट इज इन देयर आर इन हां यस यस दैट इज फाइन अधीश टॉपिक इज रियली वेरी इजी इट्स ऑल द टेक्स्ट पार्ट दैट आई एम स्पीकिंग आउट बट ट्राइंग टू क्रिएट इंटरेस्ट सो दैट कैन वी अचीव समथिंग आउट ऑफ इट सो दैट विल बी अ गुड पार्ट इफ एनीथिंग कम्स आउट अधीश मनस्विनी Uh, sir i didn't i don't have any questions okay anybody else acche bachche hain padhne lag gaye hain so okay i'll be just speaking out your names turn your camera on just give me attendance adish yes sir just So I'm visible. Not as of now. So okay. Fine. Fine, Adish. Are you she? Present, sir. Okay. Sam. Present, sir. Fine, Sam. Devanshi. ठीक है. Present, sir. Shita. Present, sir. जानवी इशिता प्रेजेंट सर दिखी नहीं ओके फाइन क्षितिज प्रेजेंट सर थैंक यू मनस्विनी प्रेजेंट 
fine manaswini namrata present sir nehal present sir rupal present sir sahiba 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 sanjana present sir shakti present sir shivani present sir okay shivani tanvi present sir present sir tridev okay tridev vivek present present sir okay yukta present fine yukta so thank you guys for your time stay safe stay healthy uh, sir ha uh, yes shakti i um just have a curiosity like uh, baking soda it has a property of absorbing odor mm -hmm. so um we can can we use it in a large scale like uh, for reducing our odor in um... not large scale soda you know that will actually have a drastic effect on ph not on a large scale but definitely it can be used um and sir uh, can we put some you know natural trees uh, fragrance trees that you know yes uh, are yes. around yes definitely they can be added up neem leaves or anything stuff like that so that that can actually will kill the harmful bacteria that may be coming up that will ultimately reduce the odor that that is a good way of controlling that process shakti okay sir thank you thank you, thank you guys thank uh, you so uh, ah, am yeah. i audible now so i am present sir saiba ji sir kya soye hue the nahi nahi sir wo actually uh, yahan pe network ka bahut issue hai to fir unmute nahi ho raha tha theek hai pets mein to nahi lage hue the apne cats mein so no, actually i am not at home i told you na i i, I was going for yeah, my yeah, brother's wedding i got it i got it yeah, thank you thank you sir